Toxic Fox. Welcome back to my channel. Um, it's about 7 a.m. And I got all my stuff packed up ready to go. Just waiting for my ride. And then we will be heading to the menu because I have my first of three Christmas markets uh, for the month today. Uh, so we're gonna load up, get some coffee. What are you doing out at 7 a.m.? Uh, yeah, we're gonna get some coffee and then load into the venue. And um, I'm excited to show you what my booth setup looks like. So I'll see you guys in a bit after I have that done. You're loud, sir. Why is there so much traffic on a Sunday? Anyway, so it is Sunday. And the show was yesterday. Um, it was actually pretty good. It was really busy, so I did not have time to <laughs> run around and film. A bunch of the show which is sad because there was some really cool stuff um but i did good it was an expensive show to vend at but i did make my money back and then some like i actually almost doubled my money back which was really good and now i have a better idea of what i need to bring to my show at the end of the month because this weekend coming up i know it's going to be good I'm tired. And I could bring like literally all of my nerd stuff and it'll sell really well because it's a Comic Con show. But the one at the end of the month is another Christmas market. It's just like a craft market, so and I have a better idea of what I should bring to that hunt and what I should leave at home, which is nice for packing sake. Uh, but I had fun. The only thing I actually purchased for myself was meat sticks because there was a meat company, so yay pepperettes. Um, but yeah, so now I get to go to work today where I'm going to go and buy a whole bunch of discontinued yarn because we got a whole bunch more mail ends in and they have my favorite discontinued yarn in them. So we're going to buy that today and we're going to stock up on some fabrics because I did get some people asking for, um, some Tweety Bird stuff because I had coasters that had Marvin, Tweety, Sylvester, and Taz. Uh, but they were the only thing I had with Tweety on them. And I had some people asking if I had other stuff with Tweety, so I'll get some more Tweety fabric. Which is fine, because that should do well at Comic-Con as well. Uh, and those I did tell those people about Comic-Con, and they said they may go um, and come and find me there. So I'll make some more Tweety Bird stuff. I did get asked for some more Pokemon stuff, which is cool, because we just got a new Pokemon fabric and it worked. So... I'll get some of the new Pokemon fabric, which I wanted anyway. And then I need to make some more Jack Skellington stuff because I've been rationing my Jack Skellington fabric because when it comes in, it sells out super quick. Um, but I haven't had a chance to make anything with the new stuff except for a couple of wallets that I have. Um, but again, I had people who were like, do you, do you have this bag in this fabric and I was like I don't but I could make one and bring it next weekend um so yeah I gotta make some more Jack stuff and some more Tweety Bird stuff and apparently some more blood splatter stuff which I mean like that's not a big deal but everybody was very interested in the blood splatter stuff Uh, and I need to make some hats that are not pom-pom. Uh, because I did have 
a few gentlemen who are interested in hats, specifically my Hudson's Bay hat, but my Hudson Bay hats have pom-poms on them, so I need to get some of that base color so I can make more of those hats uh, in not a pom-pom version. <laughs> anyway, um, I can see my ride pulling up, so I will see you guys next time. Uh, sorry, I didn't get more footage for you, but I hope you enjoyed coming along on this journey with me!